this is the quarterfinals. Male black belt, adult deficient, under 69 kilograms. The main bracket here. From Ali is from Bahrain. Ali is from Bahrain. I think I said that before in, in, in Qatar. The only changes that Ali in, in Qatar and, and, and Bahrain flag is, is just the color, but the design is the same. That's what confused me. Because the Qatar flag is purple and the Bahrain flag is red. But that's the same design. Right. So Ali Monfardi from Bahrain versus Haider from France. So the French athlete Haider Abbas leading one point ahead. His opponent Ali Manfaradi. You can see there Haider on top with the black kimono. Ali with the white kimono. Now Ali gets the sweep and two points on the score, leading one point ahead his opponent now. Stop. Now we have Ali with three minutes and 56 seconds on top and leading one point. Referee placing the right grips just like she saw before she asked them to stop. I can only imagine um, how hard is the referee job is taking a mental picture of the grips to place them back on the same position, the center, of the same grips. What a responsibility. It is. And like placing the grips right is really like can make a big difference if uh, the grips are not placed Ref correctly. Uh uh, yes, I mean, I, I know I've seen you like a uh, refereeing uh, in some tournaments and, and, and is, is that how that works? Like, is it a mental picture you, you take before you replace them back in the center? Yes, you want to make a, definitely a mental picture because, you know, if you just place those grips wrong or the position wrong, then you can just change the entire uh, game. And that would be unfair. Some guys, do they, do they play smart and change the grip as they are placed back in the center? Well, I hope not. I hope like uh, athletes that are playing here at uh, the championships that they always go for fair play. And uh, that is what I would like to believe. There would be a lack of sportsmanship for sure. Stop. Exactly. And I see here actually a lot of sportsmanship. So... Uh, I'm sure like no no one wants to win their way in a cheating way, right? Yeah, of course. That would not take like especially any now, honor. Especially now, for example, if that goes on live television for the whole world to watch it. Exactly. That that is that is gonna be your victory is not gonna taste good. Yeah, you nobody wants Bye. to be called like, hey, you are the winner, yeah, but you cheated your way. Well, you cheated there. your way there. No. So that's, that's why a lot of sportsmanship, of course, the referee is there to watch. But uh, I'm pretty sure the athletes do play their parts in, in placing the grips in the right place. You don't, want, you don't want that against yourself. Why would you do that against your opponent? You exactly. Know? Here we see a lot of a lot of movement by Ali, trying to get to the side. An advantage is granted is great and granted to him, as he's working his way to the side, to the back, and always placing a threat against Haider. Haider does get up. Stop. 
3 to 1 to Ali Monfrad with 1 minute and 40 second, 45 seconds. Let's fix the kimonos and resume the fight in the center. Hi there is representing France Hi. and Ali Monfaradi is representing Bahrain. Hi they're working here on a sweep. Ali defending well, maintaining his posture and balance. Stop. Referee dragging them to the center. Under 6 to 9 is okay, right? But I don't <laughs> think you can do okay. that under 120 <laughs> kilograms. Like you, That's right. You, you might need their help to get back in the center. I know I've refereed before, and you know, um, there was one athlete ah. that I, that he was uh, on top of another athlete, and then I was, as I tried to pull them, and like, yo, guys, I need your help. And there we have it, a attempt guard pass by Ali Monfardi. And my, my have an a, a award a point. Yes, he did. One point advantage for Ali Monfardi wow. for attempting passing the guard of Haider Abbas from France. Ali from Bahrain. Wow. Ali controlling here the hips of Abbas, working on that pass. Abbas is trying to create space for his hips. Less than 10 seconds to finish the fight. Three points ahead his opponent is Ali Mofarad from Bahrain, and he's, he ah. doesn't stop. Even he's ahead and a few seconds to finish, he did fly to that, pa to that side of control. Did not get it, but still good to watch it. Absolutely. He advances on on the bracket, and he's going to face Lucas Galbuzera from Argentina. And we have Bahrain versus Argentina in one side, and Brazil versus Brazil on the other side. Both very exciting matches uh, in the semifinals. And next on the lineup, on mat number four, in Abu Dhabi, live on Abu Dhabi Sport TV and live on YouTube, UAEJJ Federation YouTube channel. We have João Batista de Souza versus Israel Almeida. And that is the semifinal. Yep, the semifinal. João Batista versus Israel Almeida. Let's see if that's the fight that's coming up. Yes, it is. Yes, it is.